Hello, Hello everybody, everybody and welcome to an episode, episode of, of Ooh, Real ah, stories. stories. Today we are going to get Today into we've got three, three paranormal great, stories. Scary. That Let's I'm not meet type to read stories, to you guys. And make sure that you and stick just around a reminder for the last that if you have any stories, doozy, either paranormal but or in the Let's any Not further Meet ado, variety, let's get started. Email them to me at the A R S podcast at gmail.com. We're always looking for more stories. That even night, if you're not sure, I was hanging out with three bits, friends. Sarah, send it anyways, Nick, and I'll and get Mary. back to you, and I'll let you. You were know. celebrating Nick's so, birthday at his any place, further ado, which happened to have a hot tub in the backyard. After a couple hours and a couple too many beers, we jokingly suggested skinny dipping in the hot tub as some kind of birthday present. It would have probably stopped there if it wasn't for our drunkenness. So we decided to eventually say, screw it, Back in let's 2000, I was 13 now, for years context, old, living in the Midlands Mixed house of England was by a forest, in a small town was between the cities of Coventry and Lake Adding Astor. to that, it was maybe past well, midnight, with two other and anything past the one Christmas my age of and the other two years older, that were spread around we decided the yard to explore the younger friend's black. great uncle's house. Being absolute house. wusses, my going friend out there used to boast Nick's about how old the house been was, unimaginable and the fact that this great uncle Jim had a lot of keepsakes from so his past and other antiques. I followed my friends into the night we all rode with our a towel bikes over to the house, and we reached the, the hot tub first. that was worryingly close to the, in the edge garden of the woods. There was an old gnarly tree, tree, as well as Everything a lot was of fine for the next thirty minutes or so, apart from the occasional branch cracking. We decided to we go were having in. fun, it telling stories, or rambling about stupid stuff for the day, and so we poked around inside. That was until there was a indeed a lot of old items came from the darkness of the woods. None of us are lasting well off, for about five So the house seconds. was small, and it nothing like incredibly human valuable voice, was but inside. it almost didn't just sound things like that are personal worth to Jim. We all turned livid and became we silent decided to for look what upstairs. seemed like hours. This we is didn't dare try me. to look into the forest we except found ourselves for Mary, in who just drew a pair out of nowhere and picked up her bedside table with a dresser and mirror. We, we were couldn't curious, help but follow the light so we opened one of its it drawers and looked at an old the forest. Knife. Seemed unaffected this was left by the on light, top of the dress. The darkness was just. My swallowing. younger friend then opened a picture. We saw nothing. it looked like a big locket with As no chain. As we were chain. about to stop looking, though, he opened it up and placed it on the dresser top. And Mary front of shined the her light far behind. I'll never Sarah, forget that and picture. It reflected on a pair of hand eyes painted and, and very well done. The distance. It was of a woman that was the straw thirty to forty years old. Wearing we rushed a out of the tub and fancy without even giving a single thought about gathering Around her clothes. neck was a Mary big and I silver necklace Apparently, with a turquoise her balls jewel had been blown to smithereens and we all her ran eyes toward seemed the back to entrance us. as fast as possible. Seemed to know Nick where we were got a knife and her while we locked every door was unapproving. And and we unmoving. wanted to call Nick's parents or the police. We started or to anyone, freak out at this, but our phones were over Just by the forest where the three of us agreed that no other choice and it was time to put on shoes and made a run for it. He'd managed then to get his the room phone, got very but he heard cold. loud breathing Click, coming as from the as it was, forest, was a clear sign, and was, we all started to fret. Yet. The picture, what followed, knife, and everything we had gotten out of there went quickly back into Nick the dresser. Got his parents to make we heard the home. back door open, handed us towels so we could shut, finally and then cover footsteps were making their way towards the stairs. And we gathered in the basement where there were no Jim, windows. My friend, we spent who was most of the time in silence, waiting for something to happen. But no reply was given. Half an hour in, and again, we heard another shriek, more no answer. Only this time. It we was were shortly all on the by at knocks point, on the door down that couldn't stairs possibly the lower be rooms. We could see Sarah actually hear the started footsteps, crying, but thankfully now really it stopped close. after that. Then the footsteps were on Nick's the stairs, parents arrived which and we allowed could all us to plainly sleep in the see. basement for safety. I must clarify, they hadn't heard these or seen anything, were clear and, were pretty and loud, sure they and it was definitely not stuff. a neighbor or some We hardly slept, and once the morning came, something was coming out to get our stuff right in front of us, but there was nothing to be seen that we had left. I don't know how. But the only thing that there was something on the shirt sure, and Sarah and see. Mary's panties. At this point, I we wasn't wearing any that night. We ran so that left us door with two out of the house. Scenarios. We had to run through this invisible pale in order to get downstairs and out of the house. Isolated area deep I should have jumped over the stair or whatever other creepy as the footsteps were at the landing. Just decided to just at the point when we would have touched whatever it was. I and the other two were frozen in place. We were running at full pace and had oh a lot goodness, of momentum that was between a us. Crazy story. But we were frozen. Very in place. funny. We just hit a dead that stop. Story that like I kind of had to censor because on a remote. You know, I like to try and keep impossible it as this so was. Have as many I remember as straining against whatever was holding <laughs> that story trying with all my strength funny. to carry on running. Uh, but however, it was also finger. very creepy because it must have lasted you know, no longer than three seconds. But it felt for their friend's birthday. Then, you know, just as it suddenly had all begun, we all started moving it. 
because and we were all happy fighting birthday, birthday because us, this we all was landed not in the very long at the ago. Top they of said the this happened during. Uh, I pushed this my past way up and ran outside with and, my two friends. You know, a lot of people we in the comments were saying, park, you know, very quickly, oh, maybe it was and animals. Tried to make sense of what know, it just sometimes happened. animals shrieking. I've never had such a frantic conversation. Our author chimed back. No one could rationalize what just happened. She had heard, you know, like needless to say, we did not go back and had heard other animal sounds, and this was nothing like that. And also, they had thought about if it was a animal or not, but once they had heard the pounding on the door, Whoa, that it definitely that was, was a somebody. creepy story. So, you know, so props to first our of author all, for uh, I don't know responding to people in the comments people had ever seen, and just like, having a great story a scary overall. Movie so or like a scary they're skinny dipping show, in this hot tub messing towards with the antique edge of the stuff, woods, which is never why a good idea. The hot tub and the to be title of this story is actually edge called of the Don't Woods, Mess with Antiques. From like, so uh, they ended up finding logistical that out, standpoint kind of boggles my mind just, because you know. Every time Let I've seen be, somebody have a hot tub, I don't even know what it's you're always supposed very to do close with, like, to their house. Old it's like things, right but outside they're not supposed to be door. messed so with. I don't know if there's a space they issue. They need to be handled with care whatever, and respect. That kind of struck me as a little. Ghosts odd. don't like people so they go out through there, their things, and which is you know, a little goofy it's like because it's black, you know, if you're dead from their perspective, what do you expect to be of So they can't see anything. Like people have to go. So if I can't see anything and then I hear like a crazy shriek, whatever. Yeah, so, I'm getting out of there. Either way. Like, I'm not exploring. Creepy story. So, we have a explore, group honestly. of <laughs> younger kids. But I'm definitely, you know, you know main character's 13. Out, you know? so, and they have somebody I'm also else getting who's my 13 and I'm somebody leaving. who's 15 I, with them. And they decide to go to this creepy it, like house extra that their Uncle Jim so, has. And you because know, they do this because 20, they heard a lot of older things. Either way. Antiques were Crazy story. So and they thought that they they're trying to, so you know, they go up to skinny dip and, and they're have a looking good time, at and they see like a pale figure. And some old they see the knives in the reflection. And suddenly, the room like gets light into the forest. And so definitely if you're seemed like it was just a like ghost some enthusiast, perv, just like watching. Like I am, you know so that when the room very gets creepy cold out of nowhere, because why was there's this dude a presence out there? with you? And he didn't why know what their cold. plan was. Yeah, this so guy was just kind of out there already looking for whatever, flag, or just out there for whatever know, reason, up, and just happened right. to stumble upon. So for they then hear skinny people coming up the stairs, and it's like loud a wild story, but definitely very interesting. Who's and. I Uncle really Jim's liked it. nephew. It was uh, <laughs> calls out for Uncle Jim. Like I said, like, you guys hey, got to read it you? for yourself because no it's answer. very, very funny. So but they then go to the top very, of the stairs, creepy. and they hear the steps, but they don't see anything. So that's pretty terrifying, honestly. Uh, you, know, you know, so they uh, we'll be back decide with more to leave. Creepy stories, which, you know, right after this word from them today's for it. sponsor. I probably would have left that a little bit help. ago, but now. They have to go through or past whatever is coming up the stairs since they're on an upper level. And when they do this, the start of a it's new almost year like can be very they are caught by this ghost. Almost like filled with brand you know, new bugs in a spider web and where new they experiences can't move. to be had. But it can also be and overwhelming. What it also reminds me if you're of feeling overwhelmed, in depressed, like a dream -like stressed, world or anxious, where about you the know, new year or just about life I'm in sure general, that other today's people feel sponsor, this too, but better in help a lot of my dreams, I feel like you. my emotions better are help in like offers licensed five therapists times to to lower and emotion than everything else going on. You can talk to your dream therapist world. in an online so environment. They get at stuck your convenience. Like they're really they trying to get out of here, but they're just like better helps phasing through this ghost, this entity that give you access. This to help that may not be apparition, whatever you want to call it, you just fill but out a questionnaire to help assess which your is really interesting needs. because I, and then you can get matched about with a therapist in as little super as forty eight hours. Like a lot of the you times, can then like, schedule a video you know, and phone session and also room, exchange unlimited and, messages. You know, they'll make a noise or make any a sound. You can but also request a new therapist through at them, no additional charge. There at any hasn't time. really been so a lot join of the three million stories plus that I've people like who have taken so charge of their mental health. And they, they said that it lasted about three therapist. seconds, but you get ten percent off your situation. first month at better every moment feels like slash you know, real ten minutes stories. So they That's said it was about three seconds where they just couldn't move and they all felt this way. It's not like it was just real you know, our main character or all just one of her friends. All three of them. What better way and to start off the they new get out of there than taking and they charge are trying to rationalize what health. just happened and they, they do can't. that today because you know better how can you? It's now not let's explainable. Get back to the That's stories. why we have these paranormal stories. That's why we have this episode probably the podcast, eight or nine years old. 
are just my dad needed to go to this one Asian explained. grocery store at so the time in Kansas definitely City. Definitely a Missouri. very interesting story. It was a small I store, that but it was I remember just aisle that, upon you know, aisle of too much random about. goods from all over. So Asia. they're also talking it was about dimly lit. You know, does so Uncle it wasn't Jim a particularly bright know store about this entity? Anyways, like, is this a family we went there at least two times a month, so I knew where all the good candy and snacks were. Go. My and dad they was said in that their friend section, spoke to him the day the after, section. and he told him that he had I was no minding knowledge my own of an entity, when all of a sudden, or that they had been literally over. picked me so up from behind with his He did hands. tell them to leave it was his a pretty stuff tight alone, grip, though. and I remember Not feeling they, quite you know, scared needed to hear that. My training but kicked unfortunately, in, he and I was yelling for my dad, and I started to kick whoever had picked me up in the heels. Apparently, the house is sold After what felt like forever, he dropped me. purchased it. I only saw the back of his head as he walked away and out the door. their stuff has been of not of sure if I yelled family. loud enough as and my dad never came around. Family members went around him. and took their this pick. This experience definitely and stuck people, with me. You know, now that I'm a father really young of two young happened, kids, but I think sometimes they say they drive through the more. area and they don't even want to drive by the house because it still creeps them out. Holy so, moly. I don't blame oh them for God, that. That story Honestly, gives me the If I was in a haunted place, you know, like most people, you know, I remember going as long to the as grocery it's not store, like a, you know, even if it wasn't my house, mom or my dad, I might as go a back kid just to like try and, and feeling the same way. Like I knew to, where you know, the you know the snacks and that I'm not crazy you know, and the, the, the candy you know, and my stuff feelings was, are valid so sometimes because I would be separated. Something is definitely going and on, and so just the very of somebody story. trying to like abduct this kid while their back is turned is so scary. Thank God the kid had like the instincts and you know the training. To you know, we'll be start back kicking and screaming creepy, and making a stories big fuss right after this that word from today's sponsor saved his life, most likely, help. because the person then ended up dropping them and just making a run for it. Also, shout out to uh, Giant Eagle for having the little eagle's nest. I also uh, vividly remember the start that. of a new like year this little can be thing called the eagle's nest and Giant Eagle some, world. Parents would just drop you off brand new there, beginnings you know, like and new experiences to be stuff. had, and but there can would also be somebody there who would supervise. But they also had just like feeling games and little depressed, stress, computer games, or board anxious. games, whatever. About so it was actually pretty just about fun. life in general. <laughs> As I recall, today's sponsor, um, so better I think that is that here to help was you. created to better help avoid situations like this. therapists who are because trained I've to also listen and to seen help. little kids. You can talk to your you know, therapist while out in an online environment at a your convenience. So, Shout out to the Eagle's Nest. They have a broad shout range out to of expertise stores in that better help can network have something like that to you know, protect the kids. They give you access just to help that may not be available spot in your for them area. to be while the parents just are fill out a questionnaire business. to help assess your specific needs. It's just needs. really nice. And then you so, can get matched with definitely a therapist a very in creepy as little as 48 though, hours. You never know you can then schedule a video what and the outcome could have been. You know, and also I exchange unlimited messages all day with your therapist about at any time. things that could have happened. You can also but request reality, a new therapist at so no additional very charge crazy. at any time. And you so know, join the three million plus people kids at the who have taken charge of their mental health you're at, really, with an experience this better stuff health can happen anywhere. Get all it takes is a scenario just like that where a kid is left alone. A grocery store feels a little safer. I will say, you know, they tend to have cameras and workers. Like nobody's gonna see you when you real walk in and out. stories but all one word still what better way to story. start off the new year than taking charge of your mental health so do that today with better help now let's get back to the several stories. years ago i was in the midst of an acrimonious divorce from my then husband it was full of crazy allegations and typical angry filings centered around custody of our child as with many divorces Friends this and is professional a true story. colleagues seemed to pick one side so or the other. Out of my mom's, in and my in case, my there was one sort of professional contact. Who I'm now out 22. To me after hearing about the when divorce. I moved in, I positioned they my bed offered to be a witness my for my case door, because of and some I often stayed awake. Quite related that like I had any other been teen previously would. aware of. One night, regarding I had my just turned off my behavior at network but my bedroom events. light was still After on, this and my door call, was open, he started so I could calling on a semi-regular basis to and quote, the middle of make the sure that landing. I was okay. I was sitting on my phone this wasn't and someone saw something I knew out of the well corner of my eye separation. coming from the bathroom side And he was much older than I was. But the bathroom claims to right have next experiences with divorce and it went into my grandma's room. And, and I figured bedroom. it was a good idea to I looked be polite up and I saw a man with him. blonde hair Since his and a trench coat was important, along with some sort of lawyer. boots on I kept and dark things trousers. trousers. But I always had a weird he was very feeling about pale him. looking After at him. After a few months, and he looked he called a mess, day that my covered son was in dirt and everything. And when I told him I couldn't I talk out and explain why, someone had broken in he and was going to hurt my grandma and grandpa. Which I grabbed the closest thing near me, which was a book, and that he was dropping by the house uninvited. Or he was walking down the stairs for my son, and he got to the middle part again. 
He I kept telling myself and to keep things me polite. And smiled. The divorce was coming I then soon. asked don't who make he this was guy and what he was doing he had in called my me house. out of the blue. He and continued I was to walk at this downstairs. point that I was walking a very However, fine at the bottom of the polite, stairs, but the light from my interested. bedroom stopped, so it was And that if he black. got mad, he when might decide to go testify for my ex on, and say who knows what. During this time, his face was he had also helped me set up a security dirt. cam that my his dad had made. His eyes were a stunning blue color. And at color. one point, I not needed too someone dark, to walk my light. dog, and he had offered he had to do it. He had a stubble of facial hair, but he used and returned a spare key the same day. I double-checked all the doors and windows to make sure they were all locked, and insisted on sticking around to help. One evening, he showed up while I was painting, and went back to sit in my bed to try and comprehend what I just saw. Even though I was having my starting over catharsis, I've always believed in the afterlife, and that spirits exist. So I had just two after the painting day, Either he came I was around, so tired that I invited him, and unannounced, or he was an with actual magazine ghost. photos of decor. I spoke with my grandmother the next morning to see if anyone had died in the house about how, before she quote, asked if I had saw someone, unquote, to which I replied, could finish yes. decorating the house. She then I asked so what they looked out like, that I made and I described the man that I saw. I started ignoring she then told me to sit down because she had a story to tell me. dog to stay with my parents for several weeks to avoid the drop her. My dad, I came home just my for uncle custody exchanges. and grandpa were sitting in the living room. I came home a few weeks and my dad later, and uncle were thinking sitting that he would have gotten a hint. And my grandpa and, and grandma it was a quiet day. day. She was reading a the book and morning, looked up and I saw a man standing behind outing, my dad, smiling like down at him. And it was and as if he came knew back him hot and was and proud of him. I and then he just down walked out of the living room bed and, and decided to close my eyes with him. She told my grandpa, I woke and he up checked maybe the house, an hour later or so, and there were no and it signs took me of anyone else there. Something was way off. She then described him as I'm and everything off matched sleep, up with my description. I realized that there was a rose We have seen him a few more times, and table. I have recently moved out. But I most definitely but when I was telling my grandparents that I was moving in there was with a post-it my fiance, I felt something so warm and planting it in the yard. I started shaking him in the doorway because I recognized the hand. I go back to their house and I stood up to go splash some water in my face and decide whether to call parents or the police nothing sinister or evil i didn't want any trouble house. because of the divorce and anyone though. who walks into it just as i stepped warm in my bathroom calm. so i, like I realized that, that the mirror has been protecting my family in and the house notes. for years an update with super creepy i was speaking to my grandma about the ghost as she like said that my cousins were up last week but instead they're three-year-old twins and she said that they I were running down the stairs and trying to figure out that they were playing with a nice man and he was going to catch them because my friend my grandma said that they weren't scared or anything but as i went from room to room there were notes everywhere. I mean hundreds of post-it notes covering the walls, in my cabinets. That was there was even awesome. one inside I my coffee love maker. A good I started nice grabbing all story. of them and putting they them into a They don't all have to be, Suddenly, you know, I got to one in the some kitchen that made scary, my blood run insidious, cold. It said, you know, You're paranormal activity type no vibes. Watching Sometimes you. it's just like and a I realized that there was a security camera some sort of right where the note was left. After life, he had helped guardian me angel months earlier when and I didn't those think stories he was a are very refreshing. Because I called my parents those in happen hysterics, a lot. and I sent I them like a bunch hearing of photos. Them because and my dad insisted have such like a that negative I should not call the around them when it comes to a lot of these stories. About but they don't always but have to. He said that he would drive over so and change the locks with and put a chain our on the door. main character. We also who immediately changed the password living at her grandparents' house. Cameras, which and one night she sees a guy. Walking so there was one the on the front porch, house, but three inside walking the down house, the stairs, including and she gets one a pretty good in my bedroom. She's able to give this man could pretty apparently good see and hear everything going on He's inside a pale my house man for months. With blonde hair, the security cameras. Coat, I realized you know, he had just trousers, paid attention to my boots. passwords. When kind I was like, setting up the system, okay, like but the only way I can figure that he got into my house is that he must have made a copy of my house key. Normally, the trench coats are kind of and because my dog had gotten to know him, he just wouldn't have like an older guy to warn me. You know, Which also obviously he probably lived a little I was bit absolutely long ago. Horrified. Maybe a this man had been family. in my house for a and long time. I'll get back time. to that in a second. There's no way he but could so have put that many notes and on Originally, she freaked out. And he was right next to my face you know, and feet there's away from somebody my in the house while we were who's sleeping. not her or her and grandparents. And somehow thought that that was and okay. And she's worried that I left you know, and stayed with my parents trying to steal from them, afraid of what he was going to do. When he realized that he was now both physically and digitally, so they go chasing after him my house and. They when see I came him, home, my son had gone to his dad's at her, night, and, and I then just continues alone. to walk down the stairs. I was on the phone with another friend from out of town. She can't really see him after at he about goes down there because the light this from man showed up at my door was what she was going off of. Trying the locks, as soon as she goes down, screaming obscenities and, the and demanding on, to be let in to quote so his house. We already have you know, gone where all the feelings of him being nice. Where did he go? This was someone completely furious and derailed. 
She All said I could that she's always believed in the afterlife and spirits. Which felt like an so she was, this was kind Saint of Patrick's open to the idea so that sure it was a ghost, drinking. which is nice because a lot of people. After that, there were several know, other don't times where someone would start the knocking on the door literally in the middle right of the in night. Front of their eyes. Always when my so son wasn't home. She then I think he was crazy, the next but day not that and crazy. asks her grandma. And I figured like, if I called the police, he would get in more trouble if my son was And the grandma's like, but he knew the schedule, so I knew. Did you see somebody? He tried reaching out using fake social media accounts. She says yes. Always and the grandma blocked. apparently had Years a story later, to tell I discovered that where he had she friended my mom on Facebook apparition. and therefore still and was able to see was, all the know, photos of us that her, she had posted or shared. And, you know, and there was a the huge argument dad when I saw uncle that she had left her computer were sitting in, in the living room, a conversation and, you know, that they were having about a guy how standing he over my life. I sold the girl's that house dad two years later, and he looks down and he's finding new notes even as I was packing. You know, there's never any negative no vibes where I this live. Guy. He's just kind I don't of a post watchful photos protector. of my new house online. Not the dark front, night. anyway. No. <laughs> and I have changed but the privacy settings No, he's settings just like kind of looking over accounts. the family. They don't all have to be evil. I have places that he used to go. So the networking she says events that she's that actually seen them a few more and times. And I generally stay under the radar and as when, much as possible. Uh, she moved out, I could never bring myself to play back the security camera videos. Because I was traumatized enough. Told her that when her younger cousins were over, they were about three How much danger we could have been Hopefully, they said that they were he never sees this man. post. And that, but you, you know, know who you are. They were I not hope afraid or all. Don't uh, cross again. They were not afraid or anything. They were having, you know, a fun little time. And of course, they can see him because they're children. And as we've talked wow, about before, wow, 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 pets that and children can see ghosts. Story, I don't know why. Where Maybe it's begin? because they're so pure of soul or something like that. Woman I don't who's know. going through, but. You know, they divorce can proceedings them. or about and to, it's which just, is you know, already it's nice you because know, not easy. He's not trying to hurt pretty them. much anybody. You know, so he's just she's already looking over high stress them. levels. And I, fighting for custody of and they child. say that nothing sinister or evil has on. ever happened. So and that anyone that walks into the house just feels in warm in any and position calm. to deal so with any more stress. They have this positive then thought, this and I think it's pretty accurate that. The so this other guy comes along their family and says and that, you know, he has information so I'm not privy sure to, if it's, you, know, you know, a relative who had passed husband that she's getting divorced from or, you know, how if he it's acted just an owner of the house who's just a very kind person and how this could play, but, you know, there's a lot of interesting the divorce proceedings because he can be and a apparently the so grandma and the grandpa off, were the first ones nice in the house. And, you know, but Having they tried to research the life area, that and they her, couldn't find which anything. Which is how you know manipulators. But their dad and their uncle were adopted, and you know, so eventually it's possible stalkers that maybe it was get like into an people's lives. They make it seem like so it's it possible is that maybe it was their actual to be around, parent, and they you know dad, provide information relative, in certain cases, but you never and know. they do so random really tasks that make them seem like a nice and guy. And I, like, at one point, I'm he also seeing goes over that and you know tries to she get says cookies that for it her looks son, like a 1960s you know, trench coat to in a fedora. Dog so and, it's possible you know, that other things around it the house. could be it the all starts off you know innocent enough. You know, she's not very interested, but she also feels obligated to be nice. But what else was interesting was which that she is, is never a good thing talking to, about you know, using a conceal app. your feelings the app that she's talking especially about in this case it's not a good idea to app. conceal so how I'm you're not feeling really sure if this person about is making you feel app, uncomfortable i will definitely it's look like, into that and you know, get back to you to hell with the divorce that proceedings is very interesting. you could probably find another and you know we if do it's not legit i might have to try that out and i'll let you know how that goes but if that ends up obviously she knows that now but this is retrospective so i'm giving my takes um so he so I'll goes start over to the saying, house i've always been he's given a spare key because so he is my friend dog. and her partner and you know we all kind of nice gesture a little creepy for some you got know too well, over the years overall and sometimes came up really with logical explanations or left it to yet. the unknown then he starts coming around we have never had something like this happen before and well, that is part. just not Okay. So this happened <laughs> and a couple he also starts ago. using we, Me, my friend, in and her partner, talking were downstairs about things about that they can be doing around the house. Their young like, son, oh, who was four years old, old like, was no, upstairs. This is not asleep. a we situation. This is stairs her house, are in the front room, which and is where you we are not nearly that. And their four week old daughter morning, was in the Moses she goes basket out by the with sofa. her son to the zoo. We had turned off all the lights, shut the curtains, really tired, and gotten comfortable. You know, let's just get some sleep. There was a small bang, and then she wakes up. So my friend's partner went to check on their son and make sure that he was. Fine. Sticky notes, but as that the partner like walked down the stairs, he heard know, almost like quote, a wind quote, chime nice from love their bedroom. messages on them, and he said, but "Out loud, are really just like, creeping mm, her out." That's weird. One, but put said, it down as a possible draft. When somewhere. you think no one is watching, not even five you, minutes like, later, we get comfortable, sir, go to watch the who film. Who 
would my friend ever and I noticed car lights think outside. that that was like, and they're rather a bright. No, so we take and wouldn't be insanely creeped out by that. Full beams that is on some for ten very, to fifteen very seconds. Weird. Then off behavior, and we all looked at each other. Doesn't Don't sound like it's not then going again, to escalate into something A bit something longer worse. this time. Then the like you're watching flash a few times. Then when stopped. they don't know that you're there. As it stops, their son screamed, creepy. like not even Nobody a second wants that. Passed. I wouldn't And he want, started screaming and crying you know, to the point Michaela where he to watch so me when I didn't know that she was around. Sick. Like, nobody wants that of course, from anybody. As soon as I he would screamed, the dad Austin, ran straight upstairs none of my homies as my best like, friend was breastfeeding. be watching me when I didn't the know they were there. The dad brought him down, and he was like, inconsolable. If they see me... Being that he was only four, he couldn't exactly say much, but just some broken words. Grocery store or something, and they Then the TV went off with no warning. That's different. a bang upstairs, this and then silence. Is way too We spoke too for a good hour, or so, trying to and decipher what the had fact just happened. that he feels the comfortable were in the other leaving room, nowhere near any living of animal. Sticky human. note, she said. When we approached the weird. car, like my friend's partner and I, that's how you know that this man is sure not that thinking was rationally. Because we also looked normally when people car leave like a cute and had a note Google for search, somebody, and there's like up one regarding or full two. Beams just this dude left dozens, and they were intermittently going off. Even found one in there was no alarm, which is like no one around, not even a practical place to put one. son won't. She's obviously. Their little girl keeps walking and, around you know, randomly now crying, is and they've heard a couple trying to be more nice bangs. to this dude, and she's realizing I've never he's experienced a psycho. car being set on He had helped her put Usually up these security faulty cameras electricity in her house, make this happen and so he was able to see or you would have a full in her house that there was and nothing. was then able to this know when she was there well. or wasn't there, so it was and had most likely made a copy of her key. I've when had a few he experiences, to, you but know, usually with lights on. She's in the horrified. Home. Candles, justifiably noises, so, but nothing to and this level. And then, also, on Saint the first feeling I have her child's not and dress. This point, I've not had gut Patrick's feelings Day, like this regarding the comes for a few years. Pounding on her door, but I genuinely felt and watched, is trying all the locks and, and screaming unwelcome. obscenities and demanding to be let into quote his house. Not your house, buddy, and you're not getting let in. You're out of pocket. Yikes. So now she ends up selling the house. Opposite to and the last story. she goes on to this say that when she was packing up to intent, move, and she was still finding new them notes, there, which is so, so scary. When they you really first just got to look out their for warning signs. They and are at a friend's house. You got to be, their friends swift have a young son with people. and a daughter. Like, the son sometimes is letting down he's sleeping, people easy And their daughter, work. some people just need a firm breastfeeding no. with their friend. And that. They were getting you know, all set there's to watch a problem after that. So turned off the lights, shut the curtains, dealt with, and you but know, they're getting all comfy. Pretending to they heard a bang you know, upstairs, so their friend went okay to with some behavior when you're not. You know, maybe he fell. Will and, not you know, benefit you happen in the long run. Over. And again, I'm sure she knows. And that when he now, was coming down I'm the stairs, he heard like a wind chime listening from their bedroom. You know, you just gotta be. And they tried to play it off like it was possibly draft somewhere, but it's gotta move with that. Definitely um, a very scary story. No, that's story. a jingle. You know, stalking My, is always uh, wind does not cause this type you know, of behavior. Random just escalates. jingles when there's like nothing we saw around the story. to make he was that coming sound. around trying to be nice. So you know, very offering odd, to do tasks, but and then not he's crazy yet. Coming over unannounced. Like five minutes and then later, he's the going inside are on when nobody's there, when they don't know that he's there, and then off. And then he's showing up and then the hazard lights go on. You could see a pattern of escalation. Very, very weird. Unfortunately, that's normally they then hear the friend's son scream. Hopefully, she's not even a second had passed in between the lights going on at the car and the kids all. screaming and so the kids then crying and she's screaming able to you know to the point where he's like inconsolable and have it so be actually whatever followed he because a lot of restraining orders or saw it's like people just kind of scared the hell out of them even so, when there's an order against you know them, that's and then like four the things right there that, that are going on filed the within like a 10 minute span because unfortunately that's so normally how it goes in a lot of these the TV uh, then goes violence, off with no uh, warning. Cases. And then so, they hear a bang upstairs hopefully again. Hopefully she is protected now so, and he will never very, find out Very, very suspicious. Lives, that was because crazy Because something is going on now. That's six things in the span of ten minutes. So if I'm the person who's the guest, I'm leaving. Alrighty, guys. That's and going to if do I'm the person who lives of, there, ah, real I don't even know what you do. What do you burn this some you sage? I, you know, Someone Google, was I guess, in what the to do, but while we were skinny, very, 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 very scary situation. The banging is what would grab me out because I get, behind, you know, at the grocery store. I get creeped out when Alex I was at G my parents' people. house, just and hearing finally, like, 
creaking, careful, you know, just the old keys. The noises that an old house makes, intelligent I already didn't like that. 1026. But if I'm hearing like yes. loud bangs, make sure that you are careful. Who you like, give no, I need, am scared to go investigate, but I feel like I should. Of their respect something just happened. And, you if know, you have a story make that you'd itself, like to hear on the show, so please definitely a very scary situation. The and they say that podcast at gmail dot since that their son won't settle a and their Podcast keeps waking up randomly and crying and you and they've heard a couple more bangs so and finally i have sure never heard better help uh, you know, com really affect real stories cars all like for 10 percent off know, your first month of they have been known to affect technology help. and it, they Thank said you guys again so much for so, listening you know, i guess stay safe and i will see you exempt week from you know new any episode. paranormal happenings i suppose but definitely a very interesting story and in the comments the author provides an update saying that their friend has been cleansing their home and that they have been cleansing their own home as well. And that they also spent some time in their son's room letting some light in and playing some music. She said now her friend, before every night, before her kid goes to sleep, clearly states for any uninvited energies to stay away and, you know, is trying to do their best to, you know, cleanse or calm whatever entity is unhappy and they say that they have been staying in one room but tonight their son is back in their own room and the dad is monitoring and it's you know they're proceeding with caution but they say so far so good but it's just so interesting because i'm always interested in the why why is this going on what happened to this entity why are they upset and what can you do about it because it's like, they're not here anymore. So unless, it, it's hard to find out because they can't just tell you unless, you know, sometimes people can just straight up talk to them through different, you know, spirit boxes and listening to different audios. But it's hard to right a wrong that happened before they even moved in or possibly before they were even alive. So it's always just like a scary situation Whenever there's an unpleasant entity, whenever there's an unpleasant entity in a house, because it's hard to know how to proceed, but hopefully that ghost is at peace and will leave them and their family alone now. Alrighty, guys, that's going to do it for this episode of. Ooh, real stories. This week you have heard Don't Mess With Antiques by Nine Breaker AC. Then Same Man by Sammy JDH6666. And finally, Interesting Experience at a Friend's House by Queen Kijo. All stories were read with the permission of their respective authors. And again, if you have a story that you'd like to hear at the show, please email it to me at T-H-E-A-R-S podcast at gmail.com. And once again, go to betterhelp.com slash real stories for 10% off your first month of therapy with BetterHelp and get matched with a therapist who will listen and help. Thank you all for listening and everybody stay safe and I'll see you next week with a brand new episode.